Hey, what's going on everybody? So, I got something new I'm trying here. Um, 90% of everything I do on this channel is new. So, but, I get to try the food so you don't have to. That's what I tell myself whenever I'm eating something. Anyway, we have something here called, uh, I hope I pronounce this right, and if I don't pronounce it right, and I offend you, I apologize in advance, but, uh, gefilte fish. Um, it's a Jewish uh, fish, a buddy of mine from Israel wanted me to try this, and um, he uh, he wouldn't tell me anything about it, but he he wasn't like the mystery package or mystery box. I got to at least research it before I tried it. So I did get on Wikipedia and look it up, and apparently it is a dish made from poached mixture of ground deboned fish, such as carp, whitefish, or pike. So it actually doesn't sound too bad. I mean, well, I, I really don't know. I've never had it. And if I'm being honest with you, I've never had any type of Jewish food that I'm a big fan of, but I haven't had a lot of Jewish food. So we'll see what we got here. But um, I will show you the container. This, oh, it even says product of Israel on it. All right. And we'll see what we got here. I, uh, let's see. All right. All right, so it doesn't smell great, starting off. Uh, it's kind of smells like a soup that's gone bad, a vegetable soup that's kind of been sitting out. But it's not the worst thing that I've smelled. So that's a plus. Um, it's very, all right, so it looks like the gel that it's in, it's a very thick liquid. I was going to say gelatinous. I feel like I don't get to use that word a lot, gelatinous, but I don't get to use it here because it's just a really thick liquid. Um, there's some other stuff. Oh, there's some carrots in there. You got to have your vegetable, I guess. And uh, that, oh wow, that's pretty much it. That's just some big old chunks of fish, deboned fish. Um, it doesn't smell bad. I mean, like I said, I've smelled so much worse mm -hmm. on this channel. And uh, kind of give you an idea of what we're looking at here. So. Trying to get a good angle. Oh well, you get the idea. Uh, yeah, I don't know. This might not be too bad. I mean, I'm not expecting to be wowed by it by any means. But um, let's give it a shot. It's like it looks like a chicken meatloaf, and. One piece is 50 calories. So there you go. But it's only two grams of protein. Then it was a mixture of ground deboned fish. It seems like it would have more, pro more protein than that. Blah, 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 blah. More protein than that. But, mm. <coughs> All right, so it's not bad. It's not good. Um, mm. It's kind of... Mm. I did not enjoy that. Um, it's kind of like a consistency of stuffing. With a little bit of fishiness. It's got some sugar in there though. It's not good. It's not horrible. Um, I mean, I guess that's just the uh, culture in Israel. They like they. I want to say I read or uh, 
he said that they used it as an appetizer or something. But it's very, um, it's very soft. Like it's not hard. I was kind of expecting a sardine kind of thing. But it wasn't even that. I feel like if I had to compare this to something, it's like you had put fish in your stuffing at Thanksgiving. Maybe. I don't know. But that's what I'm going with. Um, I feel like the name is kind of more intimidating. Because I was... Ex I don't know. If you've seen my soured herring video, you would understand while I'm very iffy about diving into more fish so soon. But, I mean, it was nowhere near there. So, that's a plus. And as for these carrots, that's where the sweetness comes from, the carrots. That makes sense now. I feel like um, you could use this like as an ingredient in something. Like I wonder, I mean, I want to look that up. I wonder if they'd make a meal use, using this because I feel like that's possible. I feel like this would be a good challenge for like one of the Food Network shows. Like they have to use this ingredient in their dish. But scale of one to ten, uh, four. It's not horrible. It's not great. So, so haven't found any Jewish food. I'm a big fan of. But um, yeah, I'll uh, I'll keep trying. I'll keep looking. If y'all can think of any more ideas, send them my way. Uh, I want to thank everybody that's been giving me feedback. I've had a ton of great, great ideas coming my way. Stuff to try. I got people sending me stuff. Um, so just want to say thank you, all of you, and even the people watching and do me a favor and like and subscribe and I'll keep making these videos. We might even find something a little grosser than this. So, y'all have a good night. Bye.